what's up gang Brian here Brian's Law Maintenance hey just wanted to do a quick video for you guys uh, get some more blade grinder sharpening footage uh, a lot of you guys have been asking how the blade grinder is holding up and honestly it's doing really good um, this right here like I was uh, showed you guys in the first video this is a third horsepower uh, blade grinder wheel if I had to do it again I may throw down for the half horsepower one I think that one's like a hundred dollars more maybe like 450 uh, this one was just at 300 bucks so that's the only thing I may change but to be honest with you I'm sharpening two sets of blades I got one here and then I got my backup set or vice versa um, and you know what I go through both sets in about a week after two days I normally change my blades out uh, they can cut all week no problem you know with my style of residential lawns and as long as we don't have any rocks or stones and chip them up uh, but honestly they last for you know a couple days no problem so for some of you guys that have 10 15 20 sets of blades and you run a larger business you may want to go with the half horsepower version uh, that way has more power and you can kind of go through them a lot quicker uh, cleaning them all up but for most part for guys like you and me that are just uh, owner operators and you got just a couple sets you do every week um, 300 bucks for the blade grinding wheel uh, I think it's a great investment and I'm still gonna back it up and uh, let you guys know that I think it's a great buy so let me show you some more blade grinding footage and uh, hopefully you guys enjoy all right guys this is the blade before I sharpen it uh, it's gonna be kind of hard to keep it in focus but uh, right now you know I can go like this with it uh, you know we've been using this blade for about a week now on the mower it's been cutting real nice actually those photos from Instagram were the ones uh, from this set uh, we have about three days on I did it all last Thursday Friday and then Monday uh, so that's what we have on this so far the blades right here they're kind of dull on the edge but we'll clean them up really nice what I've been able to do on this is go back and forth and clean it up and then sometimes I have to elevate it to get that last little final uh, edge all right guys let's sharpen some blades and clean them all up all right as you guys can see you get the maybe a three quarters of it but the tip you have to kind of uh, elevate it a little bit and then clean it up. That's what I'm gonna be doing. That's what I've been doing. All right, I know it's a little hard to see, but we got the tip part all cleaned up. So what I'm gonna do is flip the blade upside down. I'm gonna hit the wheel with it on the backside one time and then uh, just kind of clean it up once or twice more. But that's all you gotta do, is just tap them, just kind of um, go over them once or twice, just maintain them. Don't really have to take off that much material and uh, keep it moving. Not sure if you can see this, but that is the tip of the blade. Looking real nice. Cleaned it up pretty good. All right guys, just want to wrap this one up. As you can see, there's a couple blades here that we just got done cleaning up. Uh, as you might be able to tell, they are very sharp. Uh, I am very happy, like I said, with the purchase. I know a couple guys have done some videos on them with uh, their grinders as well. Looks like a couple different options that folks do have out there. As always, make sure you're balancing out your blades. That's something I left out of my last video. A couple folks commented on. I just used a little gray cone. 
nice and simple That's all you really need but uh yeah absolutely like i said uh if you're doing anything more than a few sets a week i'd probably recommend going with a uh, half horsepower versus the third horsepower if you're doing a little bit more commercial outfit you might want to do the one horsepower but those Oregon grinders get to be uh, north of 500 at that point. So anyway, like I said, just for the owner operator guy, a couple sets a week, uh, you can see the blades are pretty sharp. I've been very happy with the cut quality. All right, guys, I'm going to wrap this one up. Don't forget your hearing protection and your uh, eyeglass protection, as always, uh, so you guys are safe when you guys are grinding blades out. But thanks so much for watching, guys, on this quick video. If you guys enjoyed it, uh, shoot it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're new. And, guys, we'll catch you on the rebound. Bye-bye.